The three men convicted of killing Ahmaud Arbery, they're headed back into court tomorrow. It's the final pretrial hearing before the federal hate crimes trial for Gregory and Travis McMichael and William Roddy Bryan. As News for Jack's reporter Corley Peel tells us, jury selection is almost a week away. This case is to determine if racism was a factor in Ahmaud Arbery's death. I spoke with an attorney not affiliated with this case who says the federal trial could take weeks. Ahmaud Arbery's killers will be one step closer to their federal hate crimes trial after the final pretrial hearing on Monday. I spoke with attorney Reginald Reeves, who is not affiliated with this case. Um, it's a different standard in this case. It's going to be more based around motivation and biasness. Investigators say Arbery was shot and killed after the McMichaels chased him down in the Satilla Shores neighborhood. Brian took the video of the shooting. An investigator testified at an earlier pretrial hearing that Brian said he heard Travis McMichael utter a racial slur as Arbery laid on the ground. A judge agreed to a request that the outcome of the state criminal case is not discussed during the federal trial. Reeves says prosecutors will look into if the three men have a history of racism. It can be any of them, tattoos, racial slurs, online activity, um, you know, people that know them. So that's what this case would be about. Reeves says jury selection could take a couple of weeks. Do you think that it might be hard to find an impartial jury considering the outcome of, you know, the murder case? Yes, um, everybody has heard of this case in this trial, and if you live in Georgia especially, um, you will be familiar with this trial. But they will expand the jury pool um, from bigger than the county. Um, you can get people from that federal district. So I believe there's up to about 40 counties that are available to pull the jury from. The final pretrial hearing is set for tomorrow. Jury selection for the federal trial begins on February 7th. Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.